New tonight, a cougar hanging around Murray for weeks has officially been released by DWR back into the wild. As news specialist Lauren Steinbrecher shows us, he was one of three cougars DWR believes is prowling around homes, causing concerns in two communities. DWR has been getting different reports of cougar sightings, not just here in Murray, but also in West Valley City. They finally did track down one of those cougars in this neighborhood this morning. Okay. Calling the same place home. He's just running through the backyard. That Chrissy Carlson calls home. Kind of crazy. A cougar caught on her cameras. I'm like, yeah, I ain't going back outside. I was just getting ready to go look at the garden and no. One of many sightings around West Valley City the past few weeks. We told the neighbor and he's like, he freaked out. So it's, it's kind of unnerving. A cougar DWR just can't seem to catch. And this one has been causing some real problems. And this one, we did get some reports that it killed seven sheep in the area. It's not the only elusive big cat caught roaming the streets recently. As calls flood into DWR from Murray. Sounds like it's a female cougar and her yearling male son that had been kind of traveling together through the Murray neighborhoods. This afternoon, they trapped the mountain lion son near homes, tranquilized him, and released him back into the wild. And while cougars in the valley aren't unusual, these three seem to be different. It's just when it's kind of staying in that area and it's a repeated thing that we want to know so we can relocate it. Because most of the time they're just wandering through um, to kind of find new habitat or, you know, follow deer herds or whatever. Even if the West Valley one has wandered off, Chrissy is staying cautious. I hesitate to go outside. Um, I checked the backyard before we let the kids go out there. DWR says if you do see a cougar in your yard, it's best not to run away from it, but stand your ground, act big, so that you can try to scare off the cougar, and of course, give DWR a call so that they can try to come out and track it. There's also more information at wildawareutah.org.